Hey everybody, I wanted to go over this problem with you. Orange Bliss has two products. It gives you some information about their normal selling price in their production last year. And what is the average cost per unit at that 100,000 production level? And then it tells you that they got an inquiry from Bartenders Association of America to buy some products for them at a special price. That means below the normal price of either 80 or 60. Here they wanted rock, so they wanted it for less than 60. And they also wanted their logo stamped on it, which required a particular machine that was going to cost 4000 So what's the advantage or disadvantage of accepting this order? So this is a special order, and the strategy with special order is incremental revenues compared to incremental cost. So here the incremental revenue is that they would get $56 for each of the 10,573. Okay, so you multiply the volume times the sales price that they would get. They're not getting their regular 60, they'd be getting the 56. And then what would cost them to make the order? Well, all the variable costs are gonna go up with this new activity with an additional 10,573 and the variable overhead. So variable direct materials, direct labor, variable overhead. And then variable selling, it tells you that they're just going to have to pay half. So either they're not gonna to have to ship it or maybe not gonna to have to pay a sales commission, but some part of the variable selling, they're not gonna to have to pay. So they're not gonna have the full $6, they're just gonna have half of it. So that's $3. And then the order has to cover the fixed cost, so let's add up all the costs, and then let's compare the incremental revenues to the incremental cost. And so here there would be an advantage of 154,595. So let me know if you have a question.